People in the Ozarks got free plants and seeds to grow at home. Chris Bryant spoke to the organizers about this opportunity for people to cultivate their own garden. So you want to explore the possibility of having a green thumb. Gardening can be very inexpensive. You can make it really expensive. But knowing where to start can be a tough road to hoe. What are you looking and for? Cucumbers. Tomatoes? Tomatoes. 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 While those two hope for a windfall when it comes to planting, Dad knows that today's event is an effort to keep the bad seeds away. A way to get the kids out in the garden to be able to have them enjoying things, eating the food that we make ourselves. Uh, I mean, as you can see, the community loves it. It's something that has always been a huge bonus for us. Cross lines and full circle gardens at Ozarks Food Harvest work to make sure those who take advantage use the correct path as they wander through the garden. Bigger each year, we we kind of refine things as, as the numbers grow. And it's just really a great um, opportunity for the community to come together and talk about gardening, growing plants, hunger relief, um, and get people excited about growing and sharing food. While many are just starting out when it comes to problems, those on hand try to nip those in the bud. We're really just trying to um, increase access to education around gardening and growing your own food and reduce barriers to gardening. The plants and seeds were free to the public as a way to make sure people have access to locally grown food through food cultivation and resources, outreach, and garden education. I like peppers, so it's great for me to be able to get all my spicy things. Um, wife's got her flowers and herbs, things like that. And for our two peas in a pod, while new tomato plants are in the harvest plans, they are keeping their eyes out for another vegetable. Because the family like cucumbers. I understand. If you missed out on this year's plant and seed giveaway and want more information about starting your own garden, you can reach out to Full Circle Gardens at Ozarks Food Harvest. In Springfield, Chris Bryant, KY3 News, and happy planting.